The heat tonight did not stop dozens of people. Take a look at that from gathering on Monument Circle for monumental yoga. WRTV's Naja Wood shows us how the annual event put on by an indie nonprofit is supporting their mission to bring yoga to students in local schools. I'm bringing yoga to schools. Monument Circle transformed into a meditation circle as hundreds of Hoosiers gathered for yoga Friday night put on by the Indie Yoga Movement. It's a gentle yoga flow. It's meant for all levels of skill, and it's just a way to enjoy our beautiful downtown Indianapolis, celebrate our city, and celebrate the practice of yoga. Celebrating and understanding the importance of yoga was why Tiffany Dinwoody brought her four-year-old daughter Campbell. I think it's a great way to show that everyone can come together and be together. Um, and I think it's just the perfect example of what yoga means. They were among many who held out despite the heat. I don't think anyone's not going to be able to endure it. It'll be all right. We knew it was hot and people would need some real hydration. We knew that we would be able to provide something healthy, hydrating, and also get the crowd going and able to participate in the yoga. The summer solstice event featured vendors, live music, and of course, yoga. Uh, this is my first time doing it here uh, at the circle, so I don't know what to expect. I'm uh, just along for the ride. A ride that was all about the community coming together to raise money for the nonprofit's mission to empower youth through yoga. We're really trying to um, bring this wisdom and this um, level of coping skills and the level of focus that yoga can provide to young people. We're bringing the community of yogis together and then it also does benefit our ability to reach more students. Naja Woods, WRTV. The organization is holding summer yoga classes for students across central Indiana along with community classes for all ages. That information will be up on our website, WRTV.com.